So yeah. for the folks that aren't in the industry, you know, they might see different types of gold. So you got 14 carat, 18 yes. carat, 24 carat, Correct. rose gold, white gold. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell the listeners a little bit about like what's the difference between the carats of gold and mm -hmm. then like the different colors? Okay. Uh, all right, let me switch We're putting gears. you on the spot. Yeah, yeah, let me switch gears here. You, you're getting me into full-time jeweler mode. Uh, so the difference in purities, right, is start, gold starts at 24 carat. Then it gets broken down into 22 carat. Um, some cultures see it as ceremonial jewelry, mm -hmm. right, ceremonial purposes. You've got 22 carat gold coins, uh, 22 carat chains, bracelets, whatever. Um, and then it's 18 carat, 14 carat, and then 10 carat. Oftentimes, you can find gold diluted even into 8 carat, 6 carat, and so on. Uh, basically, the way that that works is 24 karat is gold that is raw and purest, but it's also very soft and very malleable, mm -hmm. and it's not something ideal for jewelry. So then it gets diluted into 22 karat by adding in different alloys like nickel, brass, so on. Yeah. Then the mixture on how you keep diluting gold is by the percentage in different alloys. So if you're going from 22 karat, you might have 22 and 24 karat. 24 karat is 100% pure gold. 22 carats point is 75% gold. Mm -hmm. Then you go down to 18 carat and it keeps kind of progressively going down. Like okay. That. So the, the lower the purity for 10 carat, the lower the gold amount, but it's still gold, right? So it's just filled with more alloys. Okay. So naturally gold is yellow in color. Now